What's going on YouTube, it's Gadgets Boy and welcome to another video. Have you ever wondered what it takes to pilot a fighter jet? Well, this in front of you is the new 44 million pounds facility, which will be used by RAF and Royal Navy jet pilots. It replicates flight conditions in a fast jet fighter aircraft, such as the F-35, Hawk and the Typhoon. Flying at high speeds, rotating at ridiculous speeds is not something you just wake up and you're capable of adapting to. It's something that you require training for so you're not just only just used to it but you also prepare for it and it's great for safety measures pilots in training will experience up to nine times the earth's gravitational pull 9g and learn how to operate the cockpit under such pressure tells centrifuge can reach 9g in one second and makes 34 rotations per minute let that sink in the closest i've ever experienced something like this is 4g on a straight line at thought park and this is not the same at all Using the specialised cockpit, trainee pilots can conduct many more training scenarios to help them get used to air-to-air -air combat and can also learn how to deal with threats such as incoming missiles. The high g training facility also allows for the RAF to test new aircraft equipment for jets before conducting a life flight trial. While I was there, I was given the opportunity to experience it myself at up to 4.5 Gs for 15 seconds at a time, but after seeing the current pilots in training there go through it, I quickly changed my mind. Um, it's not scary though, they have a G-suit that is designed to stop blood pooling in your feet and legs and allows the top half of your body to remain safe and receive an adequate level of blood flow. The trousers inflate from the level of the belly button down to the feet, squashing all the blood in the leg back to the heart. As well as the trousers, you also get this mask that you have to wear. So this delivers a positive pressure breathing for G. So with a high level of pressure delivered through the mask, which goes straight deep down into the lungs and it squashes the blood out of the lungs back to the heart to help circulation under that level of high level of G. Inside the gondola itself, you have a huge curved 4K display that is powered by three Canon projectors that have been modified to make it look flat as well. So the imagery that you see, the video that you see is made look flat for a great level of immersion. So you actually feel like you're there and it feels more realistic for the pilot. The gondola itself is one of the three in the world, uh, one in Poland, another in Singapore, and there's this one here in England, and this one's air-cooled compared to the other two. It has an 11-ton counterbalance on the back, a 30-ton base, and down in the basement level, you also have a lot of electricity power in it to make sure that everything runs smoothly and it's also cooled as well. There's a lot of safety measures that's been thought through creating this machine here. For example, the door downstairs, if it's not closed, the machine can't start for example, and there's other, other level of safety measures being put in place. Above the centrifuge uh, at the top room, you have doctors and other staff monitoring the session with constant communication uh, with the pilot himself and have been trained to basically notice and spot signs of any issues during training. Doctors have to sit with you and talk you through everything and you know you just have to be, they prepare you, they prepare you very much so, so that you know what you're doing and you know what to do in case of emergencies. Anyway guys, this was really interesting to see and, and experience how it goes down, what goes on behind the scenes there for anyone who's training to be a fighter pilot, a uh, fighter jet pilot. Um, so yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up as well and share it. And if this is your first time on the channel, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell button so you'll be one of the first people to know when there's a video on this channel. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next one.